Welcome back everybody to today's video. It's a Sunday. We're heading to BAPS again. We had a rain out last night. Wonderful wife Heather's here cooking, getting ready for BAPS today. So we didn't race Friday. It looked like rain kind of Friday. Didn't look that good. It was cold and yucky. So it was on the schedule to race the Groves. We didn't. And then it turns out Saturday ended up being a bad, ugly day. Lincoln canceled early. Poor old did get the race in, but it it was misty and rainy, and we didn't go. Long story short, we didn't go. But today we're going to BAPS. It's uh, nice out. It's going to be in the 80s today. Uh, Honey Crisp is here just admiring the warm weather. She doesn't want to go out, but, yeah, she's taking it all in. So Heather's cooking. We're doing uh, pierogies, which... Ooh, it looks good. I cut the onions, so Heather's not injured today. Yeah. <laughs> so I did that. We got some buffalo chicken dip, which smells awesome. So on the bops. Here we go. Hi, I'm Billy Dietrich, sprint car mechanic and driver. I've been around racing my whole life, and it's pretty much all I know. We created this channel to share the good and the bad in between. Our crew may not be the most experienced or professional, but we get it done and we have a good time doing it. We'll show you what it's really like racing weekly at some of the best tracks in Central Pennsylvania. I'm also going to share some sprint car tutorials, mechanics, and parts, and whatever else I feel like. So like, subscribe, Ring that bell for notifications. Enjoy the ride. Yeah, boy. No, they came out awesome. Something different. All right, we're headed to Babs. Honey Crisp is having like an emotional breakdown. I don't think that she really wants to go to the races today. I think she had a bad dream. She's holding her eyes close and like, on top of me, but whatever. I don't get it. Maybe it's the shirt you're wearing. Maybe um, she's attracted to that shirt. She is like having, she's having issues over here. Are you ready to race today, Nate? I mean, yeah, yeah. Exactly. <laughs> it's gonna be a warm and beautiful day for a race. It has his favorite track. Going to Bath. Uh, I don't know if I'd say it's my favorite track. I don't know if I'd say any track was my favorite track, but I am glad that it's nice out today. And as far as right now, it is not even windy. Look at Dwight's hair, you can tell it's good weather. Yeah. <laughs> Dwight's hair always looks good. Sometimes it gets a little frizzy. Jealous. Today it's not. <laughs> it's human, it gets Honey bear, it'll be okay. <laughs> she does not. Modifieds here today. Yeah. Looks like we parked them all out front. Maybe all four tens are in the back. Mm. I, I drew an 11 group, you know, hot lap time trial, so we'll be out early. That's good. <laughs> Plenty of mud in the pit area here. No, oh, it's pretty dry. Pretty dry? chill session here. We've got Ashley, we've got Natalie, Jilly, big birthday this week. 17. She got her nose pierced. She went to Luke Combs concert. We're hearing all about it. So <laughs> of course we got White over here. He's just pounding his water. <laughs> The, the gang's all here. <laughs> Time for the driver's meeting. Okay, driver's meetings over. Normal dealer group time trial against your heat race and warm ups. 
You got modified. They don't have a full field of them. They got 35 of us, I think. So before heats, normal stuff. So we're gonna secure and keep the show moving, which is good. And uh, heat and motors next, followed by hot laps for the modified. Hot laps for us, and then we heat race first and feature first. I think we're about ready to go. All right, so here's what's happening. We don't look at the track. Track looks a little wetter than last time we were here. Less cars here, only two divisions. 358 modified with not a full field. Four tens with 35, I believe. We're in the first heat. We're the ninth car out in the heat race. Time trial horse will be the second half of the first light. Of course, we're timing against just that group. So, um, like I said, before heat races. So, that will be up next. We're going to try and keep the show moving, it sounds like. We're going to run our heat races first. It will be main for the modifies and then right into our feature. So, time trial warm ups is uh, on the agenda next. We got time good, position ourselves good for this heat race. Just go at it from there. Which one are you in? Third. Okay. Bug man. All right, so I just went up and watched the uh, first hot lap for the modifies. Track definitely look, looks a lot wetter than last time we were here, so we're going to make some small changes because we were kind of set up like we normally are. So, but get ready. Time they're calling us out right now. Tighten the wheels. Track looks kind of weird, like on the front stretch or off the floor. It's like all tilted up. It's kind of like bumpy, which is weird. It looks strange. I don't know what happened there. So they're, they were still tilting it when we went up to watch the first hot lap session. So, interesting. Yeah, you got it. Yeah, you got it. Well, we rolled at time trials. I'm just uh, taking a little survey of the surface. As usual here, maps, it's our, it's our hot lights. So as you can see, there's quite a bit of mud actually flying up in here. If you can kind of see it stuck to the bottom side of the wing. And if you follow along with any of our batch videos, you know that that's not very typical. Usually this track is dry and dusty. And today they have the, the uh, I think they're 358 modifieds or some form of a modifier here today. So they're kind of making the track a little different than normal but between that maybe some extra moisture in the surface from all the rain we've had this this past week so we're, we're green here well, actually we're coming around to good green i believe this next time we're up to speed so i'm uh just kind of feeling the track here a little bit i can tell i'm a little tight because you, you can see i'm turning the wheel to the left on the straightaway so that's never a good sign of track sweat and i get down here in the one and two i'm kind of the same way i'm kind of fighting the car to to go straight, uh, I adjust my line here, getting in three a little bit, but really not any better. I'm just just turning the wheel so hard to the left. I know I'm scrubbing off speed, and then down here in three and four, or back in one and two, same thing. I'm just just too much uh, left rear tight. I'm dri overdriving the car, and uh, definitely hurting my speed. I, I could tell in the car that we're we're going to be uh, off a tick just because the car was so snug the whole time. Unusually wet here, kind of choppy too. So we freed up while we were in staging the best we could. Corey and, and Dwight watched a couple laps before us, a group before us, but probably could have used some more staggers to help the car rotate because I was definitely locked a little bit further to the left than I wanted to be. So we probably have to free up for the heat race because our heat races are first. So we'll start fifth. Not terrible. How's Chris's mom's food? The 
delicious. Great. <laughs> it's always delicious. Hey, buddy. time um, we made some adjustments to the car to free the car up knowing how the track was in the time trial so just gonna get after it here and, and uh, you know try and make some moves here but the track is still pretty damn wet uh, right there I got pretty tight getting off the corner there and the car kind of washed up a little bit here so definitely a bunch of mama tracks so we're gonna flip-flop the cameras here and go back to the rear facing camera so you guys can get a little better of what's going on so we're coming back to the green uh, a little tight off the turn there as you looking back we see ryan newton here and he's gonna split both these cars getting into one just shroom, just flies right by him so fast you almost brought the 77 around with him spun him out no i'm just kidding he's super power fast here but no he <laughs> gets up in the cushion gets real tight there as you can see and then i get by the seven but um you know i i gain one more spot here as the race goes on but the the track is, I feel like at this point in time, maybe the track's just maybe a little soft. Um, you can see some dryness getting into three there, which is kind of normal, but the track's just so heavy there. You can see the roofs are coming off the back of the car. And uh, we qualify through the heat race, but um, you know our time trial lap just put us behind the eight ball again. So we're in the feature, but uh, we're, we're just not really comfortable with the car just yet. Finish fourth. Uh oh. Not how, how much GoPro we got. I did get um I did get some video from the stand, so that's good. How'd you feel out there? I felt all right. The changes we made were right for what we were trying to do. There probably wasn't, wasn't a lot of passing. Wasn't a lot of passing. It's just uh. Everybody spread out pretty quick. It's like the track needs to be like. Go away. Yeah. If you want to do it just like loose shit all across the track, three and four, it's just, as you can see, it's just moisture all, all across. A big piece of cushion rolled up in the middle of the corner there. I think that's what the 8 8 might have been. We did the right thing. We were just trying to free up so we could maneuver. I never really tried to top because I felt like I was going to sit too far left, especially down there. Yeah, so. I'd like I'll to take... thank the 8 8 for giving us that position too, by the way. <laughs> Appreciate that, bro. Is that bad? I mean, it's just honest. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I wasn't going to pass it. We messed up. All right, everybody. Transferred. Chris finished fifth. We finished fifth. Not sure what's going on here. We went out the top well, it was 18, and then we put in one spot.
we can either sight that tire or put that tire on. Heather, what should we do? I don't freaking know. Tell me. I don't know. What's your brain say? Change tires or sight the ones on there? Whatever, whatever your gut tells Just you. Just let everybody know that Heather looks really pretty today. And, uh, I like her new shirt. Well, thank you. And your watch and your sunglasses. You like my shirt and my watch and my sunglasses, yeah, okay? Your wristband looks good too. All right, well, thanks. Thanks for that. You're welcome. <laughs> I'm just scoring points over here. But me and Ashley said your facial hair is always different, so it's true, it looks good. That's awesome. <laughs> I like it. Hell yeah. Got the suit spot on, everything, the number, the hat, big head. <laughs> <laughs> I love it, that's awesome. Thank you. Alright. <laughs> is that the plan, Chris? For Bill's sake, yes it is. I don't think he can handle the internet or you any longer, ripping off. <laughs> I'm just here to talk about the feature. <laughs> That's what we were talking oh, about. Oh boy. I'm not gonna touch that with a ten foot pole. <laughs> anyway, features up next, 30 laps. Check out the My Race Pass, starting 14th. I'll ride all, so it just put a little bit of water on the top of the track out there, but not doing much. What is eight minutes? I don't know. So why it said five minutes? Five minutes. So. So, I don't know how. Yeah. He just, I think he just made it up. But so we're just gonna have, go with so. it. <laughs> anyway, we're gonna try and get up through there. Really realistic goal for me right now would be a top ten. Uh, any more than that would be great. I think we, can, I mean, we can do it. It's just uh, tracks is really different tonight compared to how it's been all year. So it's really wet. I just talked to Ryan Newton. He, he ran second in the B. Kind of told me some stuff about the track down one two, which we couldn't see from up here. So, good information. Corey's topping it off, and uh, we're ready to rock and roll. I just used the infamous. Blue point screwdriver. Make sure it belongs, goes back where it belongs. Not over here. For everybody who stopped me today, which was about a million people, thanks for watching the video. I like your humor, but no, not tonight. We're done with this. <laughs> Ever, but we're gonna we're gonna try. It's gonna be get so dusty. <laughs> we brought towels, and we're gonna try to wipe our face. I'm just gonna face. keep it over my nose. <laughs> is yours wet? Yeah. Yeah, she wet hers even. <laughs> it'll feel good. So this is a new new trend. <laughs> no, that's inappropriate. I know. Why'd you ask me to do that? Nate's pushing me out here for the feature and we're going to assess the track conditions a little bit and uh, maybe make a little adjustment to the car. So listen in and uh, I think Nate's probably a little more confident here than I am, but uh, take a listen. Good? Yeah, I got it. Wait, I'm feeling it? No, I'm just pulling at the track, that's all. It's still fucking wet as shit. What's that? It's still really wet. Yeah. Well, it looks like it does. It does. Alright, well. Hey, um. Come here. Put two clicks in the right rear shock. Righty tighty. 
baby. Click yep. in the right rear shot. here we're rolling up to the line we're gonna go green this time around and the track like we were just talking about looks pretty wet um, I think what happened was after we discussed it with my actually discussed it with my dad uh, the, the modifieds probably rolled the moisture back up in the track we don't usually race with these guys but um, the car is tight everybody I think is pretty tight at this point in time the, the 39 spins out right there in front of the field everybody got lucky to miss him so we're gonna re-rack him restack him and do another start here they're going to flip-flop the rows, so we're going to be on the inside this time. But, uh, you know, I, I I kind of know what to expect at this point in time because I already had one start. But uh, get a little better start there on the inside probably helped. But to get down in the inner one, the car is pretty tight. As you can see, the thing's kind of rolling on the right side. Um, see the left front shocks pretty much all the way out. But wet, muddy track again. The camera's going to get covered up with mud pretty quick here, so we're going to which is to the rear camera view right about there. And here's the, the rear facing start. Um, as you can see, the guys behind me, their cars are gonna get pretty uh, muddy pretty quick here. We fire off, like again, we're gonna get back down in here to one. The 39 is gonna spin off. If you look to your upper left hand corner, you're gonna see Chris Frank and the 69 Newton get together. And the 66 goes in the fence, smacks the wall pretty hard. Uh, we think maybe he knocked the doubling guy right there too, but uh, here's our restart again. But I know at this point in time we're we're gonna have our hands full, and like I said, the you know the track just the whole thing, both ends, even the straightaways rolled moisture back up. Looking here to your right, down one and two, there's so much moisture down there on the bottom. Actually, de develops a pretty big rut as the race goes on. Uh, and, you know, everybody's kind of down there on the bottom. This really ends up being the place to be even all the leaders move down just because the rest of the track just got so dirty from all the wet moisture on the bottom of the track that got thrown across the track so we're taking off here now we're going to go green for good and get you know even start i would say the lucas is to my outside we're kind of kind of even getting into one as you can see you guys behind me kind of everybody's kind of tight on the right side and then um same thing down here at three and four. Everybody's kind of in front of me checking up a little bit. Really not a whole lot out there on the top side. You can see it's really dirty. I see the mud on these guys' cars. So I uh, I hang out for here for a while, but you know I'm not really going anywhere. I actually get the seven car here gets me a couple laps in the race, and uh, I'm just kind of treading water, not going anywhere. And eventually I get uh, get to some lap traffic. I get to, I think the race went nonstop the whole time here, but. Uh, I decided to pull off, save the equipment here. I really wasn't going anywhere. It kind of pays the same for the first 10 spots. And what you're seeing right now is pretty much the whole race. And everybody's really passing anybody. So, see one piece, off the track. Here comes Chris. At least they didn't run away without us. No. Me and Ashley were talking about like maybe they just took off because they weren't coming back. <laughs> Racing bros forever. These people are gonna run over. How's it going? It's too tight. It's too tight. Looks like the track had more bite in the pizza than the pizza in the hay We were just, I couldn't get tight in the south. So, it wasn't going anywhere, so. Just pulled over, pulled over, like. Well, it got me out of the stands a couple laps you're, earlier. It's filthy. Defeated, defeated. <laughs> Chris! Chris, why did you pull over? I didn't want to fuck up the race for anybody else. You were slow. So. Yeah, and then, uh,
We were all like, I was thinking when he was doing it, and I'm like, as soon as they get to move over the flag again, and I don't hear nobody behind me, I'm pulling the hell off. It's like, he's like, you know what? That looks pretty good over there. It's a little too fast out there, and they were still scoot pretty good, so. Yeah, we'll get the hell out of the way, let them sort it out. It's on there pretty good, ain't it? Oh, yeah. Kind of like, uh, you know, you sit here. Sit around for a couple hours after you black out and then um, you know, take a shower, you know what I'm saying? Nate, what? What, you sit around for a couple hours, you gotta go home and take a shower because you're perfect. Mm hmm. That's what I'm saying. Well, I would hope you don't have to scrape mud off yourself before you get in the shower. I know you're talking about that one time you crapped your pants. <laughs> Your face is a tad dirty. Is it? Just. Just one of them nights we missed on the setup. You have this. Things in one piece. No point staying out and laughing the car and the motor and all that shit out. So that's why I get out of there. I knew a, I tried some different lines like getting in the three. I tried getting in wide. There ain't nothing up there. It's just all horrible. It's all dirty. That one too. Try the same thing. Like try to win wide. It's just all dirty all the way across the track. There's like patches of moisture on the bottom half of the track. You get in there and you hit them and get tight. What do you do? We just missed it. Simple as that. All right, feature's over. Not a good feature for us. Uh, we usually don't see this much mud in BAPS, even in hot laps, let alone after the feature. Uh, I think the track actually got better for the feature. Like, how about, Nate, was there a ton of moisture out there? Yeah, when you pushed I back? thought it was good. It was weird. The track had a lot of moisture in it, so we we actually went back to our, our original setup, which was, was just way too tight. So I wasn't going anywhere. I was actually going backwards, so I just pulled off. So you'll have this. Uh, we've been pretty good here at BAPS all year, but tonight we had different track conditions. So I feel like it kind of threw a lot of guys for a loop. So, oh well. We're in one piece. We'll get ready for next week. Thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, ring the bell for notifications. Thank you to my crew. They did a great job. My wife, my sponsors, Wyatt, always represent. So, Dwight. He's on the crew. I said the crew. Dwight. Oh, I just Nate, want to get him out there. He's singing. Dwight, Nate, Corey, Janet, <laughs> Julie, Heather. Tyler's on the man. You heard his finger, one of his fingers. So he went, he he's getting better. First, he went past first couple. So appreciate you watching. Tune in next time. Oh, my belly. Looks like I'm at the fireman's club again. Late night. <laughs> what is that? You can't read it, kid. <laughs> Nate. I'm gonna go walk by the Australians and tell them it's Vegemite. <laughs> <laughs> oh, your damn Vegemite did to me. <laughs>